Nobody can really do what he does, and I don't want to die. I was having a seizure, and it's kind of like an out-of-body feeling. And before Echo had started barking and I knew right away something was up, I have no recollection of what happened after that because I was completely unresponsive. Echo got on top of me because of that genetic condition that I have. He lays on me so that my joints just don't dislocate. Echo had been trained to practice doing seizure alert and response. He can smell because that scent comes before the seizure. He's able to alert beforehand so that I might be able to take rescue medication. He's my best friend and it's kind of strange saying that because he's a dog, but he really is my lifeline. And because he has been something that I rely on so heavily, it's been hard not to be without him and not to build such an incredible relationship with him. Having him is so important because nobody can really do what he does and I don't want to die.